Today, I'm going to show you how to make the Pepper's Ghost Illusion. It's an old special effects technique for creating transparent ghostly images. It works by reflecting the image of a ghost off a clear material such as plexiglass. The ghost is located off to one side where it's out of view. The plexiglass is set at a 45 degree angle to both the audience and the ghost. At this angle, the background remains clearly visible. But the plexiglass also partially reflects an image of the ghost. To the audience, it looks like there's a transparent ghost in the scene in front of them. It's pretty simple. So now I'm going to show you some ways that you can implement this technique. The simplest way to apply it is in photographs and video. Start by setting up your camera on a tripod. Then position your ghost to one side of the camera. The ghost can be a person, a computer monitor, or just a paper cutout. Hold up the plexiglass at a 45 degree angle to the camera and the ghost. The camera should see a faint reflection of the ghost. You may also get reflections of other objects around the ghost. To avoid this, you can set up your ghost in front of a black backdrop. This is a really easy way to make ghost pictures, and it doesn't require any editing software. Creating a Pepper's Ghost Illusion for a live audience is a little more difficult. The easiest example is making a ghost appear in a window. First, you need a large sheet of plexiglass. Then you need a way to prop it up behind the window. To do this, I put a table underneath the window, and I added sheets of cardboard to it to make a surface that's level with the window sill. I propped up the plexiglass in the corner of the window. I also added a small clamp to help hold it in place. Then I positioned the ghost to the side of the window just out of view. You need the room to be dark so that the edges of the plexiglass won't be visible. In this case, you don't need a black backdrop, but you do need to use a flashlight to help illuminate the ghost. The result is a transparent figure in the window that stares at people as they walk by your house. Creating a ghost in a doorway uses basically the same procedure, but because the opening is much larger, you need a much larger sheet of plexiglass. Well, that's how to make Pepper's Ghost. Try it out and have fun. Thanks for watching, and check back next week for more DIY hacks and how-tos.